Well, the USA Indoor Track and Field Championships will be held this weekend at the Albuquerque Convention Center. And among the competitors is an Olympian and national champion in the hammer throw, Amber Campbell. Yeah, take a look at this. This is oh, a video of Amber man. at the USA Indoor Nationals in 2011. And yep, she won. <laughs> she, <laughs> Amber Campbell is joining us this morning. Amber, Hi, Amber. So Good excited morning. to have you here. Thank you. Thank you for having me. This is the thrill for us. Yes. It really is. How do you do it? Can you <laughs> yeah. tell us? It, it, the hammer throw, it looks impossible. It's a lot of fun. It's just like a whirling, twirling ball of uh, just emotion and technique mm. and speed and dynamic. And I, I don't know, it's a really complicated event, but it's a lot of fun. It requires so much control, though. It does. Because, I mean, that's what you think. And, you know, you're a two-time Olympian and six-time USA indoor weight-throwing champion. I mean, so what has been your key to this consistency? Just a lot of hard work, staying after it every day. I mean, every day is something else that you can do to get better. So it's not mm -hmm. like I take a lot of days off or things like that. It's just, mm -hmm. you know, consistently staying focused on my goal and trying to do what I can do best. Mm -hmm. Do you find it helps with anger management? Very much so. <laughs> good question. <laughs> I was thinking that. Yeah. Sometimes I just want you let them go. It's yeah. good stuff. That best therapy ever. Oh, that's <laughs> right. a, it's good stress therapy. I well, like that. What do you enjoy most about competing here in Albuquerque? Well, this is like coming home to me. I actually grew up in New Mexico. Um, I'm from Tucumcari, so mm -hmm. I get to cool. see a lot of my friends that I don't get to see living on the East Coast now. So it's a great time. It's really like a homecoming. Does the climate here help or the or the air? You know mm. how in baseball they say the air goes farther in thinner air? Do you I notice like to that say difference? it's thinner and it goes further. I'll, I'll yeah. go with that. Go with that. <laughs> <laughs> well, <Just curious. laughs> you've obviously had some good training and done a, a very good job at what you've been doing because you. you have the best ever Olympic performance by an American woman in your event at the London Olympics. That is just... It's just so thrilling. It's so, awesome. so now you're back home. As you said, what is it like to return home? And what's the reception like after you've been somebody who's represented your country so well? It's been amazing. I've had nothing um, but kind words said to me and encouragement and uplifting. So, um, you know, it's an honor to be able to represent my country and do um, go overseas and represent and compete. But yeah. this has just been amazing. And coming home to so many um, great people has just been very, very cool. Mm. I can imagine. Now, what can fans expect at the USA Indoor Championships this weekend? Um, High-level competition, head-to-head okay. -head rivalries, and this All is the right. culmination of the whole indoor season. Oh. So it comes down to who gets the title today or oh this my gosh. weekend. Wow. We want it to be you. We, we want do. it to be you. <laughs> and so our viewers have to come on out and support you. Where can they find more information to get the tickets? Um, go to USATF.org, and all the information is there. There's the um, calendar of events. There's the ticket sales. Everything you need is on that website. I have to ask you this while you're here. I mean, because, you know, we all watched the Olympics. We followed it so closely. What was it, I mean, if you can sum up, what was it like just being at that opening ceremony? Um, from what I heard, it was very intense. I chose to skip it so that I can stay oh, and train because my event is the, the latter part of the Olympics. Mm -hmm. um, but closing ceremonies was incredible. So much emotion and intensity oh, and excitement. It was electric in the air. Now, were you nervous when you went? Did you find yourself more nervous in that competition compared to other ones? Were you nervous at all? Or? I felt really prepared, so I was very excited. Excited. What was that preparation mm -hmm. like? I mean, what? how do you train for that kind of an event? That level. Yeah. At that level, yeah. Um, you just make it. Even though it's the biggest event you'll probably ever do, yeah. you try to make it just like any other competition Smart. so that you don't psych yourself out and you don't think too much into the details. Mm -hmm. You just do what you've been training to do and let your natural ability fly. That's amazing. Awesome. It's so great to have you here. Thank and you I know you. New Mexico is very proud of you. Appreciate yeah, it. Thank you. Get out and support her this weekend and best of luck to you. Thank Absolutely. You.